Hey guys, so in this video, I'm going to teach you how to make bot caps. First, you need a balloon and just stretch it out so it can expand better. And blow it up to about the size of your head, an estimated size will do. And then you can tie the bottom into a knot, just like that. Just so the, you know it becomes more sturdy and solid. Next, you need a permanent marker, any color will do, just to sketch the shape of your face. So I start with the drawing of my forehead, or at least where I want the bob cap to stretch out to. And then I just basically sketch it all the way from the front to the back. Again, an estimated size will do, you don't have to be really accurate. Do include the details of your ears. Again, you don't have to put it very accurately, but it does give you an idea of where you want the latex to be later, so that you know your bot cap wouldn't cover over your ears, unless that's what you want. In that case, you don't have to draw the ears, or you don't have to care about it that much. Of course, you continue finishing the whole balloon and all the details that you need. Next, you need Vaseline and some sponge applicator. The idea is to coat all the surface of the balloon with Vaseline so that you know it acts as a lubricant before you put on the latex because if you want to peel the latex from the balloon without the Vaseline, it will burst. Next, you will need some liquid latex and a sponge applicator. The idea is basically to coat the balloon where you have sketched your head shape. So this is what it will look like after it dries so you can see that one layer of latex that wouldn't be enough to make into a bot cap yet so you have to repeat the process and coat it another layer so this is what it will look like after a second layer and after a third layer I kept it to a three layer bot cap because for this particular look I didn't need it to be so thick Next, I used a baby powder to cover the surface of the bulk cap because right now it's actually sticky. I mean, it's not sticky that it will stick to your hand but it will stick to the other parts of the latex if you don't coat it properly. So be sure to coat all of the surface. After that, we're going to peel it off the balloon. The Vaseline would be really useful right now because that layer of the beacon allows it to be peeled off so in between those layers of Vaseline and liquid latex, you want to drop in some powder. Again, this is to prevent sticking of the liquid latex. But do remember to do it gently as well because you don't want it to burst and really that will ruin your bot cap. With all this powder, you can actually fold it up and then keep it. So you continue peeling the latex off the balloon and adding baby powder in between. And after you're done, this is what it will look like. A simple bot cap that you can use for any of the characters that you want to make or any of the characters you want to do. If you feel that the outer layer that you have layered on seems a little rough for a realistic bob look, you can also turn it inside out and it will be really smooth. Another tip is to also layer the edges of your bob cap really thinly so that you can actually put it on and blend it out in your makeup later so that it will look realistic. 
if you have powdered the bulk cap nicely you can actually fold the bulk cap and keep it until you know the time that you actually need it and we're done if you like this video and you find it really useful subscribe to my channel and you can follow me on instagram and my facebook page here thank you for watching have a good day guys bye